Hello everyone. In this video, we will solve an example on combination of solids using principles of surface areas and volumes. The example consists of a spherical ball and a cylindrical beaker. Don't forget to find grasp and learn on YouTube. Subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to receive notifications on our latest videos. We aim at making learning easy for you all. Let's look at the question that we have. A cylindrical beaker whose base has a radius of 15 cm is filled with water up to the height of 20 cm. A heavy iron spherical ball of radius 10 cm is dropped to submerge completely in water in the beaker. Find the increase in level of water. So in the given example we have a cylindrical beaker with a base radius of 15 cm. The beaker is filled with water up to the height of 20 cm. A spherical iron ball is submerged in the water. The radius of this ball is 10 cm. When the heavy spherical ball is dropped to completely submerge in the beaker, the level of water rises because of the weight of the ball. Let this rise in the level of the water be h cm. We need to find the value of h. Now water rises up because of the weight of the spherical ball. Therefore, volume of water that rises up is equal to volume of the spherical ball because only that much water rises up as is the weight of the spherical ball. Now water is filled in a cylindrical beaker. Thus, volume of water that rises up is equal to volume of a cylinder with h cm as the height and 15 cm radius because water normally takes the shape of the container. Therefore, volume of water that rises up is equal to pi into 15 square h cm cube. Since formula of volume of cylinder is pi r square h and unit for volume is always in cubes. Also, formula for volume of sphere is 4 by 3 pi r cube. It is given that radius of the spherical ball is 10 cm. Therefore, volume of spherical ball becomes 4 by 3 pi into 10 cube centimeter cube. Now as we have seen volume of water that rises up is equal to volume of spherical ball. Therefore pi into 15 square h will be equal to 4 by 3 pi into 10 cube. Now pi on both sides get cancelled. When we solve the given equation for h and simplify we get that h is equal to 160 by 27. When we convert this to mixed fraction, we obtain 5, 25 by 27 centimeters. Thus, this is the value of water that rises up when the spherical ball is submerged in the beaker. Thus, when it comes to combination of solids, we equate the appropriate quantities and solve for the unknown. Hope this is clear to you all. Subscribe the channel for many such problems solved easily. Thank you.